a rewarding and cool experience to be able to celebrate those who have survived and remember those who have lost their battle. You know, for a lot of us on our team, and me especially, it's rewarding to be able to play a game you love for the people you love. Uh, when I was in the seventh grade, my mom was diagnosed with stage zero breast cancer. Um, in November, it'll be nine years since her diagnosis. Everything that I do in my life comes from a place of love. And everything that I have done well in my life has been because I've loved what I'm doing. My why was to remember to have fun, and it actually came from my mom since I was little. Like, no matter if she was dropping me off for a practice or a tournament or a championship game, she never said, like, good luck, don't let any goals in. It was always have fun. Breast Cancer Awareness Month is something that's really close to home with me. My mom has um, beat cancer twice. This is her, this November, upcoming November, will be her 11th year cancer free. And I think that some of her foundations are some of the things that I try to bring to this program, like strength and perseverance. I was 29 when I was first diagnosed with breast cancer, and I had three children, and B was only two years old. Seven years later, I came back with my motto, knowledge is power, but it was because we didn't feel alone and we're lucky enough to have had a team behind us that would have the fight. Because you have to just believe that the good outweighs the evil, because all of it was worth it just to know my daughter doesn't carry the gene. This upcoming game is important for us, important for the cause and getting people aware. We're playing for something bigger than ourselves.